Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast show. This is Expresso right here on SABC3. As you can see, we are prepped and ready for today's workout session because the World Health Organization recommends at least 30 minutes of physical activity every day. This can be achieved in the comfort of your own home, back or front yard with no special equipment. The fitness segment today will feature another common household helper, a broomstick. Who would have thought? Do not be fooled by how light it is a simple broomstick such as this one can be used to strengthen and tone muscles and align your posture among many other things so grab a broomstick right now and join us for a quick workout session Raul, it's the first time i'm working out with you yeah are you Officially, ready are you the excited? lockdown period don't be too nervous no i'm not <laughs> i am actually ready i saw what you did to jamie and um Tami, so i'm ready for you i'm just doing my job <laughs> <laughs> all right challenge accepted so thank you guys for joining us back at home if you have been continuing and have been joining us on our fitness journey, you'd know and you'd feel already a little bit of pain in the body, mm. a little bit of that DOMS, and that's a good thing. That means we're working the body, we're putting ourselves in a vulnerable state where we are actually now starting to grow, develop, and strengthen. So, adding to the beautiful business of health, we've yes. got another gym equipment hack. We've got a broomstick. A broom. Yeah. Right, grab one. You can grab the broomstick, and then what I've done is for everybody that has the excuse of, well, I don't have a broomstick at home, <laughs> I can't work out. No excuses. <laughs> I've stole uh, uh, Gogo's um, little walking stick here, and I'm only joking. <laughs> this is actually my walking stick. I've taken this beautiful specimen on many, many hikes and many road trips in the beautiful country of South Africa. Aww. So I'm keeping this close to me just to remind me of the beautiful world outside that's waiting for us Aww. when we complete our lockdown. You are so cute. <laughs> okay. So what we're going to do, guys, obviously speaking about the pain, what's going to help today's session quite a bit is it's not only a strengthening exercise mm -hmm. that we're doing in a complex, it's not only a mobility session but it's also gonna help with our range of motion okay. and just recovery in general mm. so it's a three-part kick-ass session that we're about to go right. down so what's gonna happen first is we're gonna put the stick behind our backs and we're gonna do a squat twist so the squat is obviously gonna help with strength and burning curls mm -hmm. and the twist is gonna give us a good stimulation on our core as usual that's gonna help us with our posture mm. keeping us standing straight and also yes. sitting on the couch without slouching and yes. getting a nice full breath so we've got a lot of energy in the day to make it happen so okay. just on the couch potatoes Come on, grab a yeah. broom, let's get to it. <laughs> right, so in this position, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down for a squat, hinging at the hips, making sure that we get the glutes to go back. All right, knees are, and legs are at 90 degrees, and then we're coming straight up with a twist to the one side, and then straight back into your squat, and then you're holding it down there, and then straight back into a twist on the other side, and you'll feel a nice little thoracic twist over there. Yes. Upper body is also getting a good stretch. Yes. And we're keeping our posture, and what happens is when we keep the stick or the broomstick behind you, mm -hmm. this is uh, preventing you from, if you guys see on the camera, preventing me from rounding my back. Mm. And that's really important when you guys are at home trying to pick up heavy objects, or maybe the kids have left some toys at home. We don't want to round our back when we're picking things up. We want to actually use our legs, keep our low back nice and straight, and pick it up with our legs and it doubles up ex as an exercise during That's the day. That's actually very true. So the messier your kids are, the more fit you're going to be on top of this <laughs> one as well. All right. Tip of the I day. Love that. Okay, so let's just hit five reps in, in total just All to right. give them a feel. We're going down for a squat and then we've got a twist, another squat, down for a twist, making sure our knees don't go over our toes. Beautiful form, Kushle. That lower back is nice and straight. Absolutely <laughs> loving it. One more rep, and yes. then we'll complete 10 at home for you guys that are doing the challenge. Yes. Otherwise, we'll move over to our next exercise. All, all right, right, cool. So, next exercise, what we're gonna be doing, we're gonna hit the core even more now, all right? We're gonna rest that lower body a little bit. Going into the sit-up position. Wow. Legs are at 90 degrees on the floor, and goal number one of your push-up, if you guys did the metabolic challenge, you wanna make sure that you aren't moving your feet too much when you're doing your sit-up. So try to stay away from uh, and try to get in your sit-up. You really want to lock down on that core. Okay, so okay. holding your broomstick or your stick or any straight object that's strong enough in front of you, you're going to go for a sit-up and then you're going to go for a twist at the top, hitting those obliques and then straight back down onto the ground. All right, so Kushni, I want you to try and face My your stick to the sky. My core is currently failing me, but I'm here. <laughs> All right, so sit up again, point it up to the sky as high as you can and then twist back down. Beautiful, let's go for four more. One. Beautiful stuff. Keep that core engaged. Two, 
And if you want an extra challenge, try and bring the broomstick all the way through to the back of your head. That's gonna get an extra stretch in that core region. And then on the way up, it's gonna make it even more challenging. That's the one that went to a private school. As Uncle Tabs always <laughs> said, remember to breathe because these personal trainers will not <laughs> remind you. Remember to stay alive. We just care about the bird. <laughs> yes. All right, we're gonna carry on with the core now and we're gonna also increase some mobility while getting some movement in the lower back and the spine. So what we're gonna do now, holding the stick in front of you, your challenge is to see if you can try get your feet through the stick, lying back down without your feet touching the ground. And then again, we're gonna try and reach as far as you can. Oh, I'm struggling. <laughs> and then straight back into your sit up. And that's one rep, all right? A nice challenging mobility exercise. We're gonna go for, let's try four reps, you ready? <laughs> Are we <Okay>. ready? <laughs> okay. All right, so we're gonna start in the seated position. Let's see if you can get your feet through the stick. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, there we go, nice, all right. And then try lie down straight on the ground and then go back into that restart position. Get that stick back up, lovely, fight it, fight it, I love it, and then straight back on the ground again. I need to understand how my mother can do this exercise, Ryle. Really? Yes, why, how can why, why? she, it's difficult. So what you can do is obviously, if you can't get your feet all the way around, all you can do is from this position that you are in, mm. keeping your feet in the air, keeping your core engaged, you're gonna go backwards, Okay. and then you're gonna go, come straight back up into your push-up position. All right. And then we're going right. to go backwards and then come straight back into your push up position. Mm. And you'll feel that stimulation in the lower half of your core, especially. And that's a beautiful muscle, magazine muscle for Tabisa over there. <laughs> he loves those V by lines, and this is an especially awesome one for that. Okay, I don't want to be um, defeated, so let me try that one again. Yeah, so, what we're doing is try. Balancing, keeping your core engaged, and yes. your goal is to try get the stick all the way around your feet. <laughs> oh, almost there. That's your challenge. Yet. Oh, okay, man. no, I've got this. One more time. Let's one go. More time. You got this. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, oh. so close. <laughs> we'll get it right on our Facebook Live Beautiful. after the show, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the last exercise, sorry, we've got two more actually we're gonna show you guys. Uh, I'll show the last one on the camera for everybody. So we've just finished up with the core and now we're gonna do a double up exercise, okay? So yeah. these are beautiful exercises to get that stimulation, stability in the lower half. Mm. And also we're gonna hit the rear, so the glutes and the hamstrings. For me as a sprinter, this is beautiful stuff to strengthen the hamstring. What you're gonna do is have your broomstick or your stick on the ground, your right leg over here, and you're gonna have your left leg on the floor. Okay. And a right leg in there, yes, that's correct. And right you're gonna slide leg. that stick forward in front of you while kicking your leg behind you right back. Am I trying to keep my leg straight? You're yeah, keeping your leg or? a little bit hinged and you okay. wanna try and create a straight curve all the way from your back all the way down to your leg. That is perfect. And then you're gonna bring it straight back up. <laughs> you're gonna bring it straight back up into 90 degrees. Try to keep your balance. Use the stick if you can as well. That is gonna assist you a little bit. Mm. But what you will feel, obviously, lack of balance is because I'm using my stabilizers yes. and my core to do this exercise. You want to yeah. try two reps, show the guys at home? Yes. Let's go for one. Big slide out, sticking that leg out, getting that glute stimulated. Beautiful stretch and then straight back up again, getting that core and stabilization. Perfect form. Let's go for one more. Straight stretch back out, keeping that stability and then bring it straight back up to your leg. Woo! 90 degrees. Beautiful stuff. Guys Love at it. home, you're going to do four rounds, 10 reps of each and I hope you enjoy all the magic and the burn. Let me know how it goes. Join us online, but right now we're heading over to the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs>